forgot I was gonna play I was gonna play Genshin Impact again. Let's do it. Bought this game like years ago, and never got around to playing it. And then I saw recently I they always put some big fat guy in it, like in the But there was a um I recently saw saw this Japanese like cover for a game. It's called Judgment Seven. I was like, oh shit, that looks pretty cool. Like I wonder if that game ever came out to America. <laughs> It was like, yeah, it's called Our World Has Ended. I'm like, damn it, I own that game. No, it's not an RPG. It's a visual novel, I'm pretty sure. I'm sure it's some kind of weird, like, Danganronpa visual novel-ish kind of game. has started oh look at this oh, this game's gonna start how many people understand how vague and uncertain the world reflected in our eyes actually is back then we believed we 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 were certain that the world was exclusive that we could see and touch it for ourselves all that we perceived we shared with everyone else and vice versa when you think about it there's no way to prove that the world i see is exactly the world the same as the world anyone else sees the game's loud after all the only word world i can perceive is my own Basically. Look at that way, the world starts to seem extremely fragile. He's tripping, overheating. There's steam coming out of his ears. Japan always comes up with these weird ass premises for games, dude. Or for stories, too. Like, world goggles? What the hell are they even talking about right now, dude? Suddenly, I feel so like someone poured cold water on my back. Wait, that's more or less what happened. The coldness even hurts a little bit. It forcefully, forcefully brings my conscious back from the verge of fading and completely clears my hazy vision I played a game called the uh, root film laud it was pretty interesting there's like you're trying to make a movie and like the, the subject matter that you're making the movie on is about like an old movie that was haunted and like somebody got murdered and like as you're trying to reshoot this movie or like find the footage for the movie like there may or may not be a ghost that's coming back and may or may not be trying to kill you. I didn't play far enough to be able to figure that out yet. What I see before me is a girl. Something of a silver lining in this situation. <laughs> root, uh, root film? R-O-O-T-F-I-L-M. She has facial features brimming with the roundness of youth. Large eyes full of energy and blue short hair that seemed to melt into the clear sky. Eight out of ten normal men would deem her cute, while the other two would hail her as super cute. She's a real cutie in a sailor uniform. <laughs> this fucking game's awesome already. Eight out of ten. They would think she's cute. I reflexively speak her name. I see you know is a senior at my part-time, a senior at my part-time job. Surely, uh, she is clearly a high school girl, reasonably younger than me. But that doesn't stop her from being my senior. What? She jumps at me with no hesitation. Suddenly, a two-pronged assault by an offensively soft sensation. Just one is enough to make a grown man ascend to a higher plane in a split second. 
using such a woman can uh, using such a weapon can, of such power has to be a war crime. Of these simultaneously. So, what's your list? Explain. Tell me about your list, or what are you trying to do? I saw you have like a streaming channel. Two of the two of these simultaneously would surely devastate my armies. Does she intend to wipe us out from the face of the earth? I sh shall gladly accept this defeat, for I am a man. Wait, this isn't the time to be flustered. I gently and carefully push her away from me. Doing so brings me great pain, but alas. Asakusa Roku. Was that gone somewhere? Alright, that's a lot. Mm hmm. But awareness is coming back to me, letting me remember the situation. You can't just go and come by yourself. You need to say when you're getting close. I don't know, there's something about her blue hair that throws her off. Cool. So you play, okay, so you play horror, oh, that's right, I saw you, your, your, your Twitter said you play a lot of horror games. Let's so make horror games. That... You make horror games? You seem completely fired up. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Did you ever play, um, did you ever play AI Somnium Files? I suddenly remember this thing that's been bothering me for a while. It's, to, it's a Kakigori? Is it a Kakigori? Oh, shit. Isn't that a Kakigori? AI Somnium Files. AI is like artificial intelligence or I. Uh, it's not really artificial intelligence. AI Somnium Files. Ultima and I both played that. We both kind of really, 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 really enjoyed it. And there's a, there's a sequel coming out in a couple months. It's on Game Pass if you have Game Pass. What makes them blend special is the ratio between strawberry and melon. It's three to three. Isn't that one to one? <laughs> Fucking. What the fuck kind of math is that shit? I am this main character. This main character is me. Isn't that basically just one to one? I'll ask her out that aloud, but it's best to avoid fretting over little details when talking to her. Anyway, I know why my back is so cold and heavy. There's shaved ice between my shirt and back, and it's covered in strawberry marys. Dude, my back's all like sticky. That's gross. Honestly, I didn't even want to think about the terrible state my back was in. Sure, this is summer. Summer sunlight will melt the ice and dry the shirt, but I don't know if the syrup will come off. I'm probably wearing a white shirt too. He almost passed out during a street experiment for the New World Goggles. New World Goggles are the reason why my head feels so heavy and vision is limited. Oh yeah, now I remember. You're, you're not relate to me. I'm boiling my Alexa, 30 degrees Celsius is how many Fahrenheit? It's like 90. 
86. That is not even fucking hot, dude. I'm 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 not even fucking hot, like, there's a, just a bunch of different char crazy characters. The item is best described as a full helmet. Oh my lord, what the hell is he wearing? Basically, modified bike helmet with a smartphone installed. Blocks your entire view while seeing outside through the screen, making question. That's the point why I knew it would work. Modifications also make it inside absurdly hot and stuffy, making it feel like a needlessly high-tech torture device. And here I am, wearing it in this heat. Honestly, no one can fault me for almost fainting. Don't worry. Air conditioning machine is broken. It's 40 degrees in here. I don't know what you mean, but don't worry, but the air conditioning is broken? Let's just say, there's a burning hell in this world. Then Judgment 7 base. Is it, see, I told you this game was called Judgment 7. It's weird, huh? Judgment 7 became... Our world is ended. アイ、はい。最前線の基地っていうくらいなら、せめてエアコンくらいは直してでも、夏だから暑いのは仕方ないかな。寒い夏よりはいいと思うんだ。だって寒いと掛け氷も美味しくないからね。It looks better like this. Uh, I mean, it's, I guess it's more, it's, it's not a, it's not an uninteresting title, but is it more interesting, is it more interesting than Judgment 7? I mean, it's more descriptive, and maybe Americans, th that's the hard thing about these kind of games, is that, like, they're made in Japan, and then they try to, like, make it, like, I feel like Americans don't really play, like, AI Somnium Files, that's not a game most Americans play, they don't, you know? The Yakuza stuff, I don't think really Americans really play. Oh, okay, maybe because it's got like mission structure and stuff. But like AI, so AI Somnium Files is so weird, man. The gameplay is so weird too. It's like it's like puzzly, but like I can't imagine like most Americans sitting through that. Vigorously fanning me with cheap looking fan. All it does is attract a negative attention of, by passerbys on the street, making me seriously uncool. It's, I mean, we're in Asakusa Roku, not, not too far from Sensoji Temple, and the top shopping street, making it a popular area for tourists and like, you know, I was once in Asakusa at Sensoji Temple in the shopping street, and I, I ran ran into a uh, Ewan McGregor. And then I tried to go get it. I tried to go get a picture with him, and his security guard stopped me. <laughs> a weirdo with uh, it's it's really embarrassing because I t it took too long, and I probably looked like a weirdo. If I would have just like, hey, what's up, man, and took a picture, it probably would have happened. But a weirdo with a full helm and a high school girl in a sailor uniform fanning him. The tourists misunderstanding the, the situation, pulling out their phones to take a photo of us. You know, responds in a kind by making a peace sign. Yay! Judgment Seven, I'll do your best. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. She energetic, she energetically, energetically waves her hand at them, making her absurdly large bust stuck under her uniform shake. 
making her absurdly large bust st stuck under her uniform shake. That's what, how they want you to read it. Yeah, I mean, it's, it happens. But this wasn't when I was a teenager. This was like a couple years ago. Those are J7, J7's ultimate weaponized memories for you. Their destructive power can be felt worldwide, as evidenced by their, by all the impressed foreign tourists. I'm monitoring what you see, you know. I'm not tired of looking at her breasts yet. Suck the experiments. Uh, let's do it. Hear him at the core keyboard and press the enter key over the receiver. Yukari. Which one's Yukari? Yukari's from Persona Royale. Fought for, for, for Oh shit, I know who I know which cosplayer girl it was. What's her name? It's the Vietnamese girl, right? It's the Vietnamese girl, she wears big glasses. The cosplayer? What's her name? Oh, I fucking forgot her name. I was following her on Twitter. I haven't seen her post in a while. What's her name again? Ori san said he's particularly proud of the world program. Long-winded. Oh, maybe maybe I'm getting confused. Wait, Yukari's Takeba? Oh, okay, okay. Th that pink outfit. Okay, wrong person. I was thinking about a different one. Looks like the program's waiting for some new input. Uh, program is ready. Voice, voice command. command. Isn't that a bit of wasted time? Can't you just activate it from your home? No, yeah, okay. But the problem is what? You asked and she said no? That's even more embarrassing than I expected saying those words in there. Change the world. Change the world! World program change the world. Filter is applied over my vision, displaying various info. Oh, uh, well. It's fine. It happens. The thing is, the way you get over it is by doing it. You know how many, you know how many, uh, Japanese, cute Japanese girls I asked for pictures? At when I used to go to Tokyo Game Show. <laughs> There's a lot of them, dude. I would just go around and take pictures of all the cutest girls. And some of them were like, sorry, no, I don't want you to take a picture. I'm like, okay. Like, it was embarrassing at first, but then you were like, okay, well, it's part... I mean, like, it's part of their job. The part of the job is to, like, get people to come, and sometimes people want to take a picture, and sometimes they're okay with it, sometimes they're not. No problem. No problem for them to say no. You don't have. You don't have to be. I bid you to. You know that reminds me of like one of the things I like to do. I like to to like to do it in Japan. So like I used to. It's it's kind of different now because they don't really do the physical magazines. They still do, but just not. It's not as much as it used to be, man. But, but used to when I first started going to Japan back in like 2006, 2007, 2008. Like you would go to a convenience store and they would have like a. Uh, like those uh, girly magazines, those like bikini magazines, like all in, all on the stands, 
And then I would, I remember I would walk in and there'd be like guys just lined up there, like kind of perusing the magazines. Now they're all wrapped up so you can't look at them, but back then it was like, okay, look, look all you want. And I remember I just like, I would see it and I'm like, man, that girl, that's a cute girl on the cover. I kind of want to look at that, but I was like too nervous or shy or like, you know, I did like, like if you do that in America, you'd be like judged as hell. People be like, oh, what kind of pervert are you? But in Japan, they're like, whatever. So I remember like, I remember the times when I would like, just like, okay, there's a guy, bunch of guys there. They're just kind of sitting there reading the magazines. I just walk up, pick one up, open it up, and just look at it. And then they were, they, you know, they were just doing their thing. They didn't like, you know, f flip out or like, look at me like, what are you doing? You know, no. As absurd as you do. I heard that if you're like white though, and you go there, then they'll, they'll be like, they'll they'll leave because they're, they're embarrassed to be looking at it someone of white, like foreigner. Please, menu please. Menu please. Oh my god, you have to do everything through. It's for the girls who put on the new World Goggles, of course. Imagine a girl not used to control speaking those voice commands. The picture alone is three whole meals for me. I forgot. This man is a huge perv. This is so stupid. What? <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> Japanese people are so dumb, dude. I love how stupid they can get. I properly test out the confirm and cancel. Continue this dude for many more voices and I end up shouting even more weird lines over and over again. We're already being treated as weirdo, and this only serves to make it worse. I want to crawl into a hole somewhere. How give me a shovel and I'll dig in. Crawling over there. Couldn't do it again because I walked backward even on force. People laughed at me, some people found me a nuisance, some people some saw me as a menace worthy of reporting to police. I even bumped into a scary man and almost got taken to a place. But even so, I did all of Owari's irresponsible requests, no matter how much an effort front to human rights they were. Let me just say it was hellish. Praise doesn't make me happy. Wait, what do you mean? All these experiences. This makes me happy. それでは少し休憩した後。ちょっとちょっと待って。今日はもうこれぐらいにしておきませんか。ご褒美。X mode initia oh lord.
true. <laughs> Not just a swimsuit. A school swimsuit. That's Owari-san for you. He's a true man of culture. I'm glad to be alive. You violate her rights to her likeness. You made a weird laugh. Thirties, man. He's probably in his forties, dude. I'm taking the bait. I'm doing it probably. Just try and imagine. You know something like the king. Just what kind of form would? Can I allow myself? Like, give me a bikini and cat ear combo. Sad as it might seem, my energy and motivation are back. Like they were never gone. Truly, world program and Yuno's memory weapons are things to be feared. Dance however you want while making a circle around the vicinity. Here we go. I told you this game. Japanese people, man. The premise is like it's all fun and games and goofy shit and and Yuno's memory, you know, weapons. And then now all of a sudden, do 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 do. Oh, you know. All of a sudden, as as. Good old JR would say, business is about to pick up. Clad, pure, unsullied, one piece looking at me. She's pleading for something to grow old. Doesn't feel funny. I'm not scared of her. Still uncertain about how I should handle that freezing place. Over sight when he's. The world is about to start. Vision has come black and the girls reduce nothing. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna copyright it, I forgot. Judgment seven this is Jud Judgment Seven. So this is Judgment Seven, dude. That's Ori? What the hell in the hell is this guy? Yes! Bring him, bring him, bring him on, dude. Bring these... Ayane Sakura? I think 
Doesn't that name sound familiar? Girl A. Why does that guy look like a bad guy? Wait, that was Owari? I don't remember seeing a girl with red hair, sorry. prologue is ended. I own Mine Zero. I never got to play it. I never played it, though. Because there's no easy way to, like, stream it. Hmm? わかりましたよ。レジ君やっぱり。まあ、ずっと新世界ゴーグルをかぶっていたわけだし、それにしても白昼夢で言うのを張り付けにとかね。まさか。ちょっと終わりさん。そんなに否定しなくてもいいじゃないか。そういえば
This game's about game design. Holy shit. You know, it's funny. I've had this game for like two, three years now, and the the day you come in, we play this game, and it's talking about game design. <laughs> then I was given a bitter taste of how the industry was, or rather J7 is. First of all, work hours are just insane. Game development takes off. You can barely sleep, bathe, or eat. It's common to actually spend the night in the office. Worst of all, we pay part-timers seriously low. Like, low that I'm actually afraid to calculate my own hourly pay. Lastly, the members are extremely quirky, putting up with their oftentimes absurd tasks and really tech. taxing. Our role in the company is, by the way, AD, yeah, assistant director. But no, despite, it doesn't, assistant director, but assisting director. Basically, I'm in charge of whatever ob job. Anyways, I'm back at the office. I'd like to get some rest. Hope so well. And the building. And you're gonna meet all the crazy people in here, right? So took the second floor. Let's see. Yeah. Hot team is like a weak song. Is that the best place in well, if it's really hot, aren't the computers going to overheat sometime? No, look at PC. Hmm. This guy. Iruka-san. Official name. Iruka is number two, of course. It's not his real name. He's called his soul name. Iruka is Japanese for dolphin. That's true. Like, Iruka-sensei. I don't know why you went with that number two. Obviously, a special uh, member of Jason's uh, He's role planning, role is planner, scenario, scriptwriter. Apparently, number zero is going to call people. You hard to understand. That is just something that is. I like to know more. Would you really give him a table? To help him remember the nickname he gave us. In fact, he's in charge of setting the couple of games, so he should make one himself. Zero. まだ意識が足社会に定着しきっていい。いやいや、僕の意識でしたらもう18年も前からこの世界に定着してますからご心配なく。それにゼロって何なんですか？ふんふん。人には二通りの名前があるのだよ。神の計画書に記されたセンス